when injuries can undoubtedly ruin a player's career. This is a say on Leon Bailey. So make we see. One go on. Mirror seven. is considerably the greatest sports in the world with a global viewership of approximately 4 billion. However, it is quite pretty on the eyes but can be as hurtful to that of biblical days of Samson and Delilah. But I won't go down that route. The reason for referring to such source is that the game is very attractive but can be quite cruel by choosing to work with time to simply ruin players career. It is not a nowadays thing where players are or have become injury prone to that of the likes of Jock Rodwell during his time at Manchester City or more presently Liverpool's midfielder Thiago Alcantara. Yeah, the guy whose legs are known for being as crispy as biscuits to be soaked in tea only for a cannibal to consume. No doubts. The game is quite rewarding as it issues out rewards in the form of trophies and personal awards to coaches and players. Yeah, Pep Guardiola and his Manchester City boys are recently the most recognized awardees. Now Manchester United, Liverpool, Arsenal and Chelsea, please don't be ringing off my phone asking now, what about you all? Speaking of ringing. The alarm bell appears to be ringing over the heads of Jamaican footballing talent Leon Bailey who is injured again with an armstring injury. The Aston Villa man must be tired of being placed on the sidelines having seen his brilliant start to the English Premier League season 2023-24 hits another stumbling block similarly to that of Usain Bolt's last race at the World Championship in London in 2017. Long gone the years, but Bolt is the greatest sprinter of all times. But what is going to happen to Leon Bailey? Will the shadow Mosa Diaby take his spot fully at Aston Villa, whereas he would have to jet off to Saudi Arabia? to join up with his current Jamaican national teammate Demari Gray? Well, maybe that is a league he can manage. I am sure CR7 will welcome him. Thus, he will make a lot more money, but I don't think that's the intention of Leon Bailey. The Jamaican international for sure don't want to be an Harry Kane, who is known for only scoring goals but win no trophies, or a meme ambassador to that of Harry Maguire, but wants to be a shining star in collecting both personal and team awards as sizzling to that of his dress code at parties or when he's on vacation. Bailey loves to party and enjoy himself. Yeah, the party animal in Jack Grealish can attest to that, but partying and having injury problems can be a contributing factor that may be hindering him from being on par with his high in demand training regimes in the English Premier League. A lot of persons do love the player, but when fans become tired, they will speak their minds. And by no doubt, Jamaican fans are top of the list. Where they express themselves that enough is enough with Bailey's performances. But I wish him all the best. However, the pressures in life can make you stronger, but it can also lead to you becoming a fallen soldier. Days of Leon Bailey at Barrel Leverkusen was absolutely glorious. Scoring goals and making assists for fun was what he was known for. From being critical with his thinking and decision making, with his pace, with his presence, a lot of persons worship how he plays. But coming to present time, Leon Bailey isn't that player 
that many persons expect him to be. For sure, Bailey within himself knows he will never reach on the level of the gods like Zlatan and the goat in Lionel Messi, but at least would want to be recognized for his excellence in football, rather than being a popular guy who is empty to that of empty, written by Chronic Law. By way of that, my viewers and subscribers, it is my time to go, however you have your say on this topic. Take care and goodbye.